When the logical scheme is created and there are no errors with ERC rules, you can proceed to the next design stage. The creation and filling of the new document of the 3D PCB assembly. This document receives actual 3D models of all boards that have been placed as modules on the logical schematic. You can add a new assembly document by right-clicking on the project name and selecting Add new to project multiboard assembly. Be sure to save the new file after creating the assembly document. A multiboard project has the same principle of data exchange as a board project. You can transfer data to the assembly either from the schematic by selecting Design Update Assembly or in the assembly itself by selecting Design Import Changes. When clicked, the ECO window opens where it will be offered to add all previously placed modules from the multiboard schematic. Here you should validate and execute all changes and then close the window. The camera control layout in the multiboard project is the same as the camera control in the PCB editor. Also when working with the assembly editor, a new multiboard assembly panel appears in the workspace. This panel represents the assembly tree. It displays all place boards, mates and other elements of the assembly which can be added later. Each edit board is presented as a set of drop-down lists, including a list of components on each side of the board to manage their visibility. You can also use this panel to add another multiboard assembly, a single PCB or 3D stamp model to the assembly. To add a board or assembly, click on the proper option and then select the board document. However, consider the fact that such boards will not be transferred to the logical schematic sheet of the project and this functionality should not be used to add new modules to the schematic. You can delete boards and other elements that you have added to an assembly. To do this, first select the object to be deleted and then click Delete. If you have deleted a board project that is present on a schematic as a module, or you have added a new project to the schematic, you can synchronize the assembly again using the Design Import Changes tool as shown earlier.